what's up you guys welcome back to my channel by the title of this video you already know what your girl's gonna be doing it's time for me to go freak hygiene shopping when i say i am literally out of almost everything i am literally out of almost everything nothing in here out of this so i'm probably gonna restock on this one look at my little mask literally literally it's time it is time. So I'm here in Target. I'm gonna make like a list of everything I need to get. So first thing first, let's get oral. All right, y'all. So I'm in the oral care aisle, and the first thing that I need to get off of my list is a tongue scraper. I need floss, and then I need my wash. Okay, so this isn't the tongue scraper that I wanted. I wanted the pack that like you could like do it and then throw them away but this will do so i'm going with this one this and it says it's right bad breath 90 percent bad breath comes from a dirty tongue clean yours that's what it says there so i'm gonna go with this one need some floss and i need my wash so the floss is already here so i'm just gonna get one of these as far as floss go i think i'm going to go with the grin and next let's get some mouthwash like their breath has the best, best, absolute best mouthwash. I already tried um, this flavor. This is honestly my favorite flavor. I had this one before and I had this one. And I'm literally, I had this one. Don't really too much care for that one. Currently on this one now. Um, it's so so. But I'm going to go with the mild mint. No, no, no. I'm going to go with the clean mint, y'all. This is literally the best. If you are not using this as your mouthwash, throw all of these away. <sighs> Please get their breath. So we can go ahead and mark off tongue scraper, cut floss, and then we got mouthwash. Now let's move down to the body care. Okay, guys. So I'm finally in the body care and native is the brand that I really, 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 like really, really, really like to use. But they really don't have a lot. I think people done bought them up or whatever. But the lilac one is like my go-to and the cucumber mint is also like my go-to. But I haven't tried the grapefruit and bergamot. I think that's how it smells. So let me smell it. Mmm. Okay, let me do the lilac, let me see. This one has like a soft, subtle smell to it, and that's why I absolutely love it. It's not overpowering, but I like to use like light scents during the day. So this one is good for like light scents during the day. And then this one is also, it's a little bit stronger than that one, but it smells absolutely good. I mean, you can't go wrong with native. I think I'm gonna go with the grapefruit and bergamot. Mm, it smells so good. Also was thinking about trying like one of the raw sugars. Okay, so this is the beach rose coconut and milk shea. Let's see. Oh my god. Literally, this smells so good. Okay, this is the green tea and cucumber aloe vera. Mm. See, this is the lemon sugar. Mm, mm -mm. No lemon sugar. This is the pineapple maca berry and coconut. I'm gonna go with this one. Y'all, it smells so yummy. So this is gonna be my day back wash. Cause you know, I got two. So let's go ahead and look for my nighttime one. All right, for my night one, I think I'm gonna go with this one, which has shea butter in it, which I really think that shea butter to me is like a nighttime scent, but that's just me. And guys, it smells so freaking delish. Like, so good. Are these the ones that go So I can go ahead and check out soap. All right guys, this, is my holy grail when it comes to deodorants when i tell y'all i have had so many of these deodorants it doesn't make any type of sense native you should sponsor me please i had the lavender coconut and vanilla lilac and white tea the lipless and mint one on cucumber and mint these are too too sweet too freaking sweet for me but i think it's this great no this sweet peach and nectar baby this one literally smells like heaven. Like, I cannot tell, like, heaven, y'all. Like, oh my God. 
smell it, y'all. Don't that smell good? Like, it's so freaking sweet. So I think I'm gonna go with this sweet peach and nectar for my deodorant and we're gonna keep it rolling. So, all right, I need to get a sugar scrub. I feel like the sugar scrub that I wanna get is this raw sugar. I like my sugar scrub to be kind of like hard. So I really like this one, let me see. Oh my God. Look at that consistency and it, babe. This is the watermelon fresh mint. It smells so good, y'all. I don't even need to smell no more. I'm getting the watermelon raw sugar shrub. All right, I am now in the body care section and I'm gonna show you guys the lotion that I like for my body. This is the lotion that I'm gonna get. All right, so I do wanna get me some body oil. I'm not sure if I want the Palmer's. I don't think I want the coconut one only because it has a scent to it. I prefer my body oils to not have a scent to it because when I layer it with my perfumes, I prefer like putting the oil that doesn't have a scent so my perfumes doesn't collide with the oils that does have a scent, if that makes sense. So I think this one is, I tried this one and it does not have a scent on it. I never had this one before, but it says 48 hours moisture. All right, I don't really need this because I already got that and then I got the body oil. Body oil. So literally, y'all, we moving right along. Next, we going to the feminine wash. I don't need this. I right, got that, I right, got that. So, we don't need to get those in. And now we can go ahead and head to Ulta. See, I done break the dang. All right, in Target. So I'm gonna get majority of all my facial care from here. Let's go ahead and look at the stuff that I need. All right, this is my go-to good molecules. I absolutely love them, but I need the toner. And it doesn't look like they have the toner. Oh, uh, so this is one of the toners. But the one that I had was this coloration. We can try this one. I need to get facial cleanser and this is the one that I had with La Roche purifying cleanser this is the one that I did have but y'all my skin is not oily so I need to, an oh look at that that's the last one too I'm gonna get the normal to dry skin hydrating gentle cleanser I feel like this is the one that will best fit my skin now I need to get a lip scrub and a lip oil this is one of the ones it's by Soap and Glory. We're gonna try this one out. Right next to it is my favorite, 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 favorite lip balm, which is the Shea uh, Butter Vegan Lip Balm. And they're only $3.99, so it's about what? Six bucks, so we're gonna get those. Y'all, look at this. It's got molecules on the other side, and they actually have like the brightening serum, all of that that I need. Get this brightening toner here. I need hyaluronic acid i believe i need this as well this is the um hyaluronic acid that i had that i was showing you guys that i was out of this is the ordinary brand i absolutely love that one but like i said i got the good molecules one so i'm gonna try that one and then i'm gonna let y'all know how it goes but i do need the moisturizing cream the ordinary natural moisturizing cream for my face i'm not gonna get that box i'm gonna get this box and i think that is it guys okay. i am back i got all of my goodies just go through like a quick overview of what i got so i can show you guys because i feel like maybe i've been rushing through it because i was in the store but let's start off with tarjay as far as lotion goes i got the nivea i just love love nivea i think it does really good with my skin so this is the only lotion besides Jergens that I use, but you cannot go wrong with Nivea. This is the body oil that I went with. I have another body oil that I like, but that one has like a scent to it. And I wanted to get like an oil that does not have a scent because when I layer like my, like when I layer my body oils on top of it or my perfumes, I really want that to be the scent, not like, the oil, I don't know if that makes sense. So this one is 
the Palmer's, it's the vitamin E oil, and it does not have no type of scent. And like, I put it on my skin when I was there, and my skin still literally feels so good. And that was literally like five or six hours ago, so I'm gonna put it on tonight too. But this is the Palmer's vitamin E body oil, and I absolutely love it. I love this one, y'all. So this is the one that I'm gonna pair with this body oil here, which is the Gucci Guilty. Hmm. So I'm gonna pair, well I got a lot of body oils like this. But I'm gonna pair my oils with this, especially during the day, because you know, when you pair your oils, your body oils, your body perfume oils with like an actual body oil and lotion, your perfume and stuff, it tends to stick on longer. So if you didn't know that, now you know, so try it out and let me know. I got three different body washes. I got my old and good faithful native. And this is a scent I haven't tried before. It's the grapefruit and bergamot. I think I'm saying it right. And it gives like a, it's like a sweet, it really does, like you can really smell the grapefruit in this, which I'm really not a big grapefruit person. So for me to get it, it smells really good. And I also got the raw sugar simply body wash. This is for sensitive skin. It's beach rose and coconut milk and shea. Y'all, this smells so Y'all, this one right here, so I'm gonna pair these two together. I just think like it's gonna smell so good. But I'm telling y'all, this literally smells so good. Like, oh, it smells so delicious. Like, I can eat it. That's how it smells. So I'm gonna pair these two as my daytime body wash. For me personally, when I'm like in the morning times, if I'm like when I'm taking a shower and stuff, I like to have more sweet, airy. I like to smell like that during the day. And at night, I like a more, um, like a more coconut, more shea moisture type of smell. So I don't really like using the same body wash for day and night. Um, I just think like stuff like lavender, coconut, shea moisture makes me feel more like relaxed and I can go to sleep and stuff. And then things like, you know, like the body mist, I mean like the waterfall type smell of the strawberries and stuff like that. That feels like a more daytime, like springtime, like I'm springy, I'm getting up, I'm doing stuff in the day. That's what that gives me. So I don't use the same body wash pretty much. So the body wash that I'm using for night is the Olay Ultra Moisture Shea Moisture. This is what I'm using at night. This one really, smells like I'm, I can't wait to use this one it smells so good and it's not it just it just gives a really 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 clean like clean feel like feeling and stuff like that so this is the body wash that I'm using tonight after raw sugar scrub this is my first time getting this one but I do notice that this sugar scrub has a more tougher like a more scrub scrub type consistency look at that do y'all see that consistency it is so like, like I need, when I when I think of a sugar scrub or any type of scrub that I'm putting on me, I really want something that's really going to like scrub my skin and like, like I need a hard scrub. I got my good and faithful native deodorant like, if you ain't wearing native, native, native sponsor me, sponsor me, sponsor me baby. But if you ain't wearing native, what? Are you freaking doing it? As far as oral care, I got the Double Clean. I've seen pretty good reviews on it, but I also have this, guys, as water flosser as well. So I like to use these two together. I think I get a more clean, like I get a good, 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 like a really good, 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 good cleanse when I use both. So this is all I got for my oral. And then I also got me a tongue scraper. If you, if you're not, cleaning your tongue, what are you doing? Like, you better clean your tongue. Like, clean your freaking tongue. Clean your tongue. Okay. Now let's go ahead and get into skincare. I had got the Hyaluronic Acid Serum. This is the one that I have only like an itty bitty amount of, but I really needed some more, so I got the holler on it as a serum. And I'm not even gonna lie, if you have dry skin like me, like sometimes I'll wake up with dry patches on my skin. I used to. Now that I'm doing this like facial routine, I have not had a dry patch in a minute. So if you want a facial routine, I'll drop it for you. I'll give you guys that for the, for the girls that got dry skin. I got you. I got the azelic acid. This is more so like a hydrating type cream that I put on my face. Like improves like brightness and it improves like the appearance of your skin texture. I literally swear by 
this thing right here. Like it is so freaking good. Like then I got my good molecules. This is just the hyaluronic serum. It's literally it's literally the same serum like the one that I showed you guys earlier today. And that's how much the bottle looking that's how much comes in when you first get it. So, so, so freaking good. And I got the Natural Moisturizing, it's like a hydration um, moisturizing cream. Well, I never tried this out, so I'm gonna try it out for like a month and see what happens or if it irritates my skin. But so far, I have nothing but good things to say about Good Molecules and The Ordinary. Like those two products, I wanna say I swear, I swear about Good Molecules. The Ordinary does pretty good, so I don't really have no bad reviews about it. Like I said, I have dry skin. And the products that I use really work well for me. Boom. This is the one from normal to dry skin, which is for your girl. So I got another brightening toner. Love. Love, 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 love. The brightening toner. Like, make sure you guys are toning. Like, this is the box. Absolutely. Like, I'm telling y'all, all y'all are going to see here is like good molecules. And um, the ordinary, I just swear by their products, and I absolutely love them. Two lip balms for Shea Moisture. This one is my go-to. This one really like if you have dry lips, this literally moisturizes your lips. Like it's only four bucks. I don't know why people are not talking about it more. It really does moisturize your lips. No, I have not. Listen. I deal with a lot of discoloration in my lips and sometimes throughout the year I get like black spots on my lips sometimes like it will come and then sometimes after a period of time if I'm using a certain lip balm that lip balm does not work anymore it actually dries my lips out or it makes my lips feel dry or I get this burning like this burning sensation type feel on my lips whenever I use a lip balm even if it wasn't doing that before it started doing it after a while I have not had any issues with Shea Moisture I like the lip balm that one just works for me. I don't went from Carmex, I would get Burpees, I use the one in that blue tube that you gotta dip. The one back in high school people used to dip and you like, man, you doing too much. You can try the little balm that's in a circle that you can do. None of it, it'll work, but then it'll dry my lips out. But I have not had any issues with Shea Moisture, but if I do, you know, I'm gonna tell you. As far as lip scrubs go, I'm gonna show you the ones that I swear by, and then I'm gonna show you the one that I just started using, or that I'm gonna use. So this is the e.l.f. version. Um, It is like a coconut, this is how it looks. Kinda look a little messed up, because I like put it on as if it's lipstick. But I absolutely love it, because like I've never had no issues with it at all. Like when it comes to my lips, I never had any issues with it. And I like the I like what it does for like my for like my lips. So that's the one I use. But I got this Shea Moisture. I mean I have the tree the tree hut one and this one is like in a mint flavor. This is how it looks. I I haven't seen no people of um you know I haven't seen that many people try it but we're gonna try it. We're gonna see what it does. I also have this lip scrub that I got from Ulta that you can use to scrub it with. That's the one that I got. Cause you know, we gotta have some cute lips. Like, that's what I use. And then last but not least, I have this um, ultra smoothing lip oil. Um, This is what I am going to try out. I, I did like the, I think it's the Knits lip oil but like I told you guys like my lips kind of dry out when I put certain stuff on it and that's what that one was doing to me so I wanted to try a different one but I might revisit it with like a different one because I have like the pink one I might do like like a different type versus the one I had because it does work and it does moisturize my lips but after a while like it starts to like itch and I have to take it off and I don't like that I have a whole lot of stuff, but I also have a lot of other products that I wanted I wanted to show you guys, but I'm probably just gonna show you guys when I do my like actual night routine because it's so much and it's not what I bought today. But 
Guys, that's everything I bought. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. If you're new to my channel, make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. Join the family. I hope you guys really did enjoy this video. If you have some hygiene products that I haven't listed here or you have something that works for you or for dry skin, leave it in the comment section below. Let me know so I can kind of like test those out and try them for me because you know, we, we like to try new things over here. See you guys for watching my video and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.